urbanization and secondary cities and satellite cities simply because Rwanda is in a transition. It's moving from a rural society to an urban society. Now Kigali is of course the big city, but the, rural, the secondary cities and, and the future satellite cities will become important stakeholders also in uh, the economic development of Rwanda, where people will be living, but also having their jobs, job creation, and their economic and social development. Mokare kwa msa onze cha ni hano mu mu mujirgo agati haga chiro kari gahari ka kabu kashora koki pawa nyamuri jango swari mu ayari haga chiro gashaje kani akari gato ya kari mu mfunda rongo. Yima ya kani chiro katu wat na wajeshi na nuru bomba kumiji shiriz kuka kui au kwa kure la gahari mu mfunda rongo hara hano abi bida chiro kumiji shiriz abumu. Nonu <laughs> Ariko bungu bunge na hundi ya hanga ha, bana kwa amafranga ni ne, ari yari yonje ni. Yewe mubuzi mabusanzwe, hakazi na dinfite, ariko nyuma yuko nuye muri yumurenge, kwa giza mahiri yeye kujirango agachiri rokazi mu murenge dutu yemo, haba damu tukarati ni uze kuko dushowa yeye, bifuereo izimba horgo sisi la dutu unde tu baye hona chivas. The new Agakili law has uh, uh, so much uh, boosted the development of uh, social economic development of the uh, uh, neighborhood. So it has contributed in creating jobs. And this comes in the line with the, the National Strategy for Transformation, NST1, vision. Well, in Musan's Jagachiri, we have 7,000 square meter built, that's only one fact. The most important is in fact we have 500 people working there, handcrafters, and during the construction over 500 people have been working their temporary jobs of which more than 20% were women. 